30. All right, we'll send it over to Michael Coos now in our North Vancouver Bureau. He's filling in for West Lacay today. Good morning, Michael. Yeah. It's nice to see you. Good. Mary, it's great to see you too. Even when I'm not filling in for Russ, we still see each other in the olden times when we're both at the station. Uh, I'm here at the North Van Bureau. Of course, Russ has taken this rainy morning off and it is pretty soggy. We're just getting into this initial wet weather, but let's start off. Weather, by the way, is brought to you by Innovative Fitness. And we look back to a beautifully sunny day out at Lighthouse Park, your BT view this morning. Julie Sweeney took this amazing photo. What a location Lighthouse Park is. This is close to high tide when this photo was taken. There are some little uh, amazing little isolated beaches out there. It's worth checking out for sure. To send us your BT views, just hashtag BT views and at BT underscore Vancouver. So let's start off by taking a look at the current conditions. Right now we're at 14 degrees. We do have some rain coming down. It's still pretty light, but it's starting to ramp up along the coast and will continue to do so as we move through the morning. Well, let's take a look at some of the regional temperatures. 13s, 14s, pretty much everywhere. It's a little bit cooler in Chilliwack at 12 degrees, even though the rain hasn't really ramped up in that part of the valley yet. So let's take a look at the radar now. Here's what we're seeing locally. You, you notice that swath of rain along the coast. It's slowly tracking inland. The heaviest bands of precipitation are just out over the strait, out over the island, coming up over the Olympic Peninsula, broadening out a little bit. We advance to see a, a wider view, and you can see where that swath is. The rain band takes it all the way down the Washington, Oregon, Northern California coast. That entire wave is going to move through through the day today. By the afternoon, I'm expecting things to dry out quite nicely, as was the case yesterday. So let's take a look at the seven day forecast. Your daytime high for today with that drying trend into the afternoon up to about 18 degrees. I know tomorrow doesn't look great temperature wise, but it won't be too bad. Just some scattered showers, otherwise mainly cloudy and a high of 16 into Sunday. Right now I'm keeping it dry. Mix of sun and cloud back up to 18. We're back into the rain as we head into Monday and then things start to improve on Tuesday. And you'll really notice that Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, by Thursday and Friday of next week, we're finally seeing some summer-like weather as we get toward the uh, start of the summer season. Your daytime highs back up into the mid-20s, so it looks really, really nice. 